I spent most of my um, early childhood in Weymouth, Massachusetts. Well, there was still, you know, a fair amount of factories around. So it was something that just visually, you know, struck me. And that kind of thing stayed with me, you know, over the years. When I decided that I was going to go to college and went to, went to what, what was then Southeastern Massachusetts University. They had a very large collection of industrial looms. Uh, they used to send us down to draw. Machines were extremely complex, uh, many, many components, and they were unbelievably detailed. So we would spend hours, you know, drawing these things. Most of my work had always been hand-drawn. Uh, then I started doing some photo etching, working with a solar plate process, which is a, a polymer plate that develops with water and the image is exposed, a positive image exposed on the plate uh, and the light hardens the non-image areas and then the image areas that stay soft so when you develop it with water it actually forms um, like incised lines and depressions that hold ink. The woodcuts are very different though. These are done from my paintings and from my drawings where we photographed them and then uh, printed them onto a plastic film, a vinyl film. And then from there, adhered that vinyl film to the wood block and then cut 